James Hirecheck with today's Auto Chartist technical analysis of stock trends for Friday, April 27, 2012. Our technical analysis of stock trends has identified two equity markets to watch for Friday, April 27th. Today's stock market report will feature Procter & Gamble Company and United Technologies. These two stocks are Dow 30 components. Procter & Gamble, stock symbol PG, has formed an emerging triangle chart pattern on the 1440 minute chart as seen here on the screen. Our stock market analysis suggests that a downward bias is developing at this time. Now the overall quality of this chart pattern is an average five bars. The initial trend which measures the strength of the trend prior to the chart pattern formation is slightly above average six bars. The uniformity rating looks for equidistant tops and bottoms. Its seven bar rating suggests a strong occurrence of these as well as numerous successful tests of the support line. The clarity rating is a weak three bars. This indicates a high presence of market noise, most likely caused by this prolonged sideways action and choppy action since early March. Now, according to the theory of technical analysis of financial markets, the triangle chart pattern is a non-trending pattern. However, its gradual narrowing of support and resistance typically suggests impending volatility. The more prices compress inside of these barriers, the greater the likelihood of a strong momentum following the breakout. Now, another stock to watch is United Technologies Corporation. This is stock symbol UTX. After several weeks of consolidation, this equity market appears ready to challenge the auto chartist's key level resistance at 8160. Since this level has been tested at least three times according to its significance rating, the fourth test may trigger an upside breakout. And you can see there's a lot of room up here if this market can break through this resistance barrier. Based on the main range of 87.50 down to this bottom at 78.35, the first target of a breakout is likely to be the 82.93 area, somewhere up here. This price represents 50% of this aforementioned range. If the breakout takes place as anticipated, then in order to sustain the move, the general rules of stock market technical analysis call for this old resistance to become new support. So put it in simple terms, if we do get the upside breakout through here, we'd like to see the market continue and follow through. However, on any pullbacks, we'd like to see this old resistance area become new support. Since both of these Stocks are components of the Dow Jones Industrial Average. Again, that's Procter & Gamble and United Technologies. The Dow Jones Industrial Average is the stock index to watch for direction. Although there's been a strong upside bias this week in that index, our equity research indicates an overall sideways trend over the near term. So if the Dow Jones shows an upside bias, then United Technologies is likely to show a strong gain or a breakout above here. If the Dow Jones average shows weakness, then you're, you're likely to see Procter & Gamble break through support. This is why it's important to look at, both, at stocks on both sides of the market at this time. This stock market report has given the trader a stock with a downside bias, Procter & Gamble, and an upside bias, United Technologies. And it's up to the trader to read both stocks and to read the in, in combination with the Dow Jones average to gauge the strength of each move. This has been James Hirecheck with today's Auto Chartist Technical Analysis of Stock Trends for Friday, April 27, 2012.